Gina, spring has sprung. And, and spring has sprung. <laughs> There's definitely. a lot of dogs and cats, and we really need people to come take a look before they uh, go anywhere else. Yes, we have lots of purebred dogs here. Um, this, obviously, is not a purebred <laughs> dog. This is Alex. He loves people, as you can tell. He's a, a husky mix. He's got one blue eye and one brown, but he is the sweetest boy. He um, is about two years old, we, we think. And he was just picked up as a stray over Aww. over off Wolfland. So okay. Um. Well, he's so lopsy. Um, he just lays down. Like a while ago, we were telling him to come on. He just laid down and wants you to scratch him. He just loves people. That eye looks wild. I mean, it uh -huh. is a, a really really blue ice eye. blue. Yeah. yeah, yeah. He's so cute. But I think he would be um, for a family. I think he'd be adorable. And he's yes. Still, look how calm. Yeah, he's very calm. And he, um, if you do have other dogs, we would like you to bring them to meet him. Yes. before you uh make the adoption final um he's yeah he's a good boy i wish you would look at the camera <laughs> so i could see your face but well, he just loves people i mean he's just yeah. so he, he wants nothing but uh but for us to love on him what what advice do you have for a spring has sprung and maybe i know it's cat season puppy season it is, I mean, yeah it's about to be kitten season if you uh my first advice is if you can't afford to have your dog or cat spayed or neutered we have a program called No Balls for Baxter. We can help you with that. Get them fixed. Do not have any uh, oops litters because, yeah. you know, we have a lot of people who say, you know, I found good homes for all of them. Yeah. But I guarantee you half of them will end up here anyway. Um, oh, people just, we, they gave uh, numbers yesterday at the Animal Control Board meeting and out of all of our impounds, 20% of them, 22% to 24% are owner surrenders. Wow, that's too much. That's we, too much. We want to help that, and always check at your Humane Society here in Amarillo. Gina, you really want to help people fostering, and, and maybe yes. if you can't adopt, you've got some uh, bleach, you've got some towels. Y'all are always in need. There's all kinds of things you can do besides fostering or adopting. Uh, we do we do need bleach, and we always use need gently use towels. You know, don't take them to Goodwill. Bring them to us. We we bathe and dip everything that that comes out of here. And that's the second thing that I would recommend for the summer. Um, flea and tick season, it's, it's upon us. It's only March and we're already finding dogs with ticks on them. Really? Yeah. And go now, go, go. And if you have any questions, y'all give some good advice on how to do that. Yes, and um, just get, get some kind of flea and tick preventative um, and get them before, before it gets bad. Good advice. You see on your screen how to get a hold of the Amarillo Panhandle Humane Society. We love our dogs and cats and we want you to come out and look and, and uh, please help these animals spay and neuter.